Joe with Joe Lee Farms in Vilcabamba, Ecuador. Welcome back to the channel. So I wanted to just kind of bring you a quick update to our Huga Culture gardening system here. Not everything is a struggle here in Ecuador. We're having great results. As you can see in our Huga Culture bed here, we've got broccoli just thriving. What you may not be able to see is in between the broccoli, we have this wonderful lettuce growing in there. So we planted this on what I would call intensive spacing and the broccoli is actually shading the lettuce. And the lettuce loves it. We pick around the outsides of the lettuce and let it continue to grow from the middle out. And uh, it just works fantastic. The broccoli, especially here in the middle of the bed, is growing extremely well. And the reason it grows better here is it gets more sunlight right here. Um, at the other end of the bed behind me, it's not quite as much sunlight, so uh, not as, as vigorous a growth. The other end of the bed was full of carrots, as you might remember. We've harvested all those out. Soon we'll start planting zucchini down at that end. And we cover all of this with our uh, insect netting. And that keeps all the bugs and all the little worms out. So we've taken a uh, quarter inch rebar and we've slid over the top of that, this half inch mangara, what we would call in the States as a poly tubing uh, for water lines. And so uh, then we bend that once we've got it in and it makes these great little hoops, very inexpensive. We run some string down the sides just to kind of keep the um, sides of the netting off of the crops when it rains. Um, that way there's not something wet laying up against the leaves causing disease and issues. So this is working extremely well. We hope we're gonna harvest some great broccoli out of here. We've had some great broccoli from the uh, property in the past and uh, it's worked really well. The Hooger culture beds are just so much fun to work with. It really uh, holds the nutrients, et cetera, in there, as we've mentioned before. And uh, the giant logs in the bottom of this bed are just decomposing, giving it all the nutrients that it needs. Hope you like this video. Give us a thumbs up.